if i am using a mobile phone in the technical terms we do not say it is a mobile we say it as the ms ms means mobile station that is the combination of your mobile plus the sim card because you know that your mobile is having a unique number as well as your sim card is having a unique number now in the many series like crime patrol or maybe savdhan india you have seen that they are going to trace the IMEI number or IMSI number so if i talk about the IMEI number international mobile equipment identity that is of your mobile unique number and what is talking about IMSI number that international mobile subscriber identity that is of your sim card number the combinedly we can trace any mobile phone combinedly means let us suppose that your mobile is lost now somebody is not very intelligent he just uh, take out the sim card and throw it and after that insert his own sim card that means your imsi is no more there it is lost because sim card is lost now once the sim will be inserted then your imei will be taken with that sim now the mobile company if they want they can easily track out that phone with that imei number but vice versa let us suppose that if somebody is not very intelligent in your mobile is stolen and now they have taken your sim card and inserted it in their phone but they just throw out your phone again that can be traced because still the imsi number is present so both things are very dangerous in terms of mobile communication and it is not like you are using the data only even if you are not using the data you are normal having the conversation then they can trace out because we know that this is the mobile station and there is some tower nearby we know that the towers are placed at every few kilometers now those particular towers are having this type of three antennas actually these antennas are at the angle of 120 degree each so the angle between all the antennas is 120 degree they are covering into three regions that is a funda they have done by the mobile companies means uh, this is the region okay they are trying to divide in 120 degree of the angle and your mobile phone is connected with that antenna the antenna which i am mentioning are the cup antennas like this but today the antennas you have seen that they are the 3g and 4g antennas they are in the bar shape in many of the towers you have seen the antennas like this today they are applying this this is the 3g 4g antenna they are also in the 3 into number multiple of 3 afterward this tower is connected with the bts base transceiver station you have seen that nearby that tower just where the tower is placed there is there are some devices which are placed from where the multiple wires are coming that is the base transceiver station means they are transmitting and receiving transceiver transmitter plus receiver then after that this wire is going into the local exchange let us suppose in the janakpuri we are having the local exchange that is called your bsc base station controller and all such towers means there are multiple bscs in delhi let us suppose that the bsc of some other area lakshmi nagar moti nagar they are coming to the one main exchange that is called the msc so one msc mobile switching center main exchange have the local exchange of your area so in your janakpuri having the exchange in your uh, lakshmi nagar having the exchange similarly some other area we are having the exchange then further they are having their own bts the bts can be more let us suppose that this is the janakpuri exchange if i make it precise this is delhi in the delhi there are multiple area let us suppose that this is janakpuri and this is the lakshmi nagar this is the sarojini nagar okay then further even in delhi there are multiple towers so every tower is having their own bts so that means in janakpuri there are again multiple towers bts is connecting like this 
and there are the antennas now how the call tracing and all thing happen what is the purpose of your uh, exchanges if i say the bts that is only for transmitting and receiving there is no other part of bts bsc where you put all the bills and local requests you are putting that is the local exchange but main exchange there everything happen what you are doing if you are if your mobile phone is lost and you have put the request in the police station that mobile phone is lost and yes they are going to uh, trace your phone your phone is into the three categories sim card into three categories one is your white list one is gray list and one another is the black list the people like us who have submitted our aadhar card photo is done every document is submitted they are into white list if your equipment is faulty some document is not submitted you are getting the calls that uh, you are this one document missing please uh, visit the exchange that is the gray list black list the people on which the mobile company or the police is going to track that is into the black list now here such blacklist people are reported to the msc means in the msc there is the provision of cdr call detail record in the few months let us suppose 6 months call are always uh, there means where you have even called outgoing call or even incoming call means even you have put the miss call that entry is stored then the cdr so single command if you are entering to put the cdr the last 6 months data can be easily given to you 6 3 months to 6 months depend upon the company as well can be given that yes these are the miss calls and all but if you are into the black list properly your all calls are secretly recorded also there are the softwares which are present in the msc your all calls are recorded means if anybody is your biggest enemy present in the msc so that person can record all your voice also so your voice what you are talking is there although today we are having all the things we are having the security standards like wap wpa then wap2 the standards are there that is one to one encryption is there and they even say that your call is totally encrypted but still mobile company if they want can easily track out your data means what are the messages you are sending what are the things you are doing they can take everything from you you know it if you are registering on various apps of finding the names now those apps maybe let us suppose that you are registering on some of the app who is giving you the name caller id of some person means you is some call come and they show you the particular name of that person if you are registering on those apps how they are taking that data because they are taking your contact details after that soon after one year or six months you get some other messages also take out this plan that thing how how they are capturing your data because you are giving your data by yourself the smartphone is the most unsafe thing we are using today because they promise that everything is encrypted but yes if some of the complaint regarding you is registered obviously government can intervene there are special cells so they can easily take out your data data that is the possibility so you should be very much uh, aware about this thing to never share your personal details or personal even if you are having some photographs in your mobile so keep just having all these things do not send them i am not saying that any particular company i am just telling you to do not share on the particular websites or this chatting platform everything is unsecure so this is uh, how the call is working and yes if if your complaint is filed in the msc what is happening they are broadcasting broadcasting means they are saying that this particular person we want to search they will deny the person is not in my range not in my range it will say yes in janakpuri again your particular subscriber identity is sent in all the locations from there it will say no it is not in my range it is saying it my range 
now it is going to send in all the direction means they will get trying to take out your direction and they will find that yes in this area the subscriber is there in this area now you assume that this is the x axis this is the y axis just like in your screen you are having the x and y axis let us suppose this is a dot i want to find this location so i can say that this is the y axis this is the x axis the value of x is 3 and value of y is 4 let us suppose similarly they are saying that the value of x is this way and y is this way so your mobile location is somewhere this one so coordinates of your mobile are sent immediately to the police station mobile phone and sometimes we have seen that police request that in every 15 minutes a message should come of that location so every 15 minutes the message is sent means the cdr is updated means the the updated location of the criminal is sent to every 15 minutes in their mobile phone if the jeep is going behind that person so they receive that yes the person is moving in that direction okay so this way the call tracing also happen in the mobile companies